Schools are open in Blizzard ravaged Buffalo today. A driving ban in the Queen City was lifted just after midnight, replaced with a travel advisory. Mayor Byron Brown says significant progress is being made on snow removal, but he's still asking people not to drive if they don't have to. At least 40 deaths have now been reported in western New York from the blizzard that raged Friday and Saturday. The drive to help, that's exactly what Michael Johnson, a Lafayette snowplow driver, did. He and his colleague worked for two straight days in western New York. Johnson is back home sharing his experiences with Ira St. Moran. For Michael Johnson, growing up in Lafayette and now owning a plow business, clearing out snow is like second nature. So when a friend in Buffalo asked for help, he and his colleague Connor Horse did not hesitate. My intention was to, to go out and make, make a living, but uh, it turned into much more than that. He's owned pro snow removal since 2008, but said the conditions there were like anything he's had ever seen. The snow banks were as tall as the uh, street signs, the stop signs. Cars were in the middle of the road, just snow piled on them. We had to maneuver around them. It was like you know, like the end of the world kind of situation. Johnson doesn't get much use of it here, but his company's specialized skid steer that has a snowblower made all the difference. We were able to go right through that ice like nothing. So it literally got it right down to their bare driveway or to their bare parking lot. He found neighbors through Facebook groups and even helped siblings concern their elderly father was having a heart attack clear snow in time for emergency crews to arrive. There was like five or six people trying to shovel out this driveway and obviously not making a dent. We came in with a machine, we blasted it out real quick, and, and then the ambulance rolled up and they were able to take this guy away. And uh, I just heard from, from the daughter this morning that uh, he's going to be okay. There wasn't much downtime while they worked 48 straight hours, but getting that good news made it all worth it. One of the reasons why I got into business was to help people out. He did just that and then some. In Lafayette, Iris St. Moran, New Channel 9. Amazing. Johnson and his team do not have any immediate plans to return to Buffalo. He is connecting people who do reach out to him to other plow drivers he knows in that area.